All right, so I am recording this directly after the final clip of the previous episode. And one of the things I did in the time between uh, recording the final clip of the montage in that episode and recording the final clip of the episode was getting all of these and a carved pumpkin. I have uh, 64 plus 12, 76 end crystals. And I've also uh, destroyed a substantial portion of this end tower just because I needed obsidian. And I have placed a sextuple beacon in the end. My plan for this is to spawn the dragon 20 times, uh, or to uh, actually 19 times to be specific. And then I will do that all in this episode. So depending on how fast it goes, this may either be the whole episode or just a portion of the episode. Uh, for all I know, this could be like an hour once it's in an edited format. Uh, but I'm just going to get straight to it and kill me a dragon. Put this on. Boom. And get right away from that portal. And there we have it. The end again. So I'm gonna go around and I'm gonna try and keep my distance between me and the end crystals. And I am also gonna keep my distance between me and the dragon. Um, and if I am ever getting too close to the dragon, I will swap my chest plate on. Because almost definitely whatever fall damage I will incur is going to be... Uh, better than what the dragon will do to me. So, like, as you just saw, that was only a heart and a half, but if it flings you, uh, it can get really bad kinetic energy, and you will die. Boom. Put this back on. Oh, this is actually kind of hard to aim. I don't go under her because I've had tragic things happen under a dragon before. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Um, but I, I will go near her. Oh, my end island is really not built for this, is it? Dragon fight number one of 19. I guess two of 20. Oh, that really fucks with the season beam. So. Ah, actually, it's not too bad. Nice. Alright. Dragon number two. Get. You should always get clear of the crystals. You have a while before they explode, but it's it's never worth the risk. Also, I'm going to turn down my game audio because I realized in the last episode that the game audio was way too loud. Um, so probably this first Dragonflight's audio was also too loud. So I try to do with these, if I can shoot it from the ground, I will. And if I can't, if I have to go up into the air, I, if I absolutely have to go up into the air, I will. You motherfucker. Ow! That hurts. Oh, I should actually have my golden apples. Like this. I don't really need anything else in my inventory. Oh, I wonder if they'll hurt her. When she perches. I don't think they can. There. 
What the fuck? She's running circles around me. Three of 20. So I may not do all 20 of them in this one recording, but I will get them all done by the end of this video. That's the one thing I can guarantee. Or I'll die. Come on! I missed every hit while she was perching. Oh my god, Jesus Christ! That was so fast. I didn't even have time to get in position. Fuck you. Oh my god. I actually considered streaming this, but I figured it would be better to leave all of the, the action for the YouTube video. Also, I'd, I wouldn't, if I ever had to go back to the overworld for anything, I don't want to show off the real progress I've made. For a sense of time, I am halfway through writing episode two right now. Yeah. So, what was that, four to go? I, I don't know. This is number five. Get ready to destroy this one immediately. Wow, that was a good shot. Oh, I got that one too. Jesus. I'm on fire right now. What the fuck? Ah, not quite. Oh my god. Would fucking one of my shots hit, please. What the what the fuck? This is a joke. This is not real. Fuck you. Oh fuck you. That was so fast. Nah, I'll get it. Number six. I need to be very careful not to blow those up because they will probably immediately kill me. Whoa. That's the kind of thing where if she hit me, she might have launched me straight into one of the fucking things and I would have immediately died. And that was the perch. You motherfucker, get out of my way. Put that on. Watch her. No. I have totally not been talking. I have been focused up. These are probably going to start going by quicker uh, in terms of like the actual time it takes me in the video runtime. Also in literal time because I'm, I'm getting used to the rhythm. I was already tired when I started this recording. I, I can't, I don't know how long I'll be able to go on for. I'm gonna turn my game audio even lower. And my finger is off left click. Because I, these are still end crystals and I can still punch them and immediately die. Uh, but here's number seven. 
I might cut it when this bow runs out of durability, because I'm not even sure if it can be repaired. Uh, and if it runs out, it's that. Yeah, that's probably end of the line, because last time it was 33 levels, I think. So this one, it's got to be nearing 39, which is the limit. Ow. Motherfucker. I, I gotta I gotta have more commentary. I've I've been dead silent since the fight started. But I am hitting more shots. Maybe that's the secret. I really wish bows were affected by strength. Cause I'd be doing so much damage right now. Really the strength is mainly just if I aggro any Endermen. I can fight them really easily. There. I'm probably gonna go to ten. I don't know after after 10, because it's 1 a.m., and I'm waking up earlier now, so I am, I'm tired. I, I feel like I'm going to die if I go past 10. Okay. 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 Popped. There. Oh, that covers the very end of the, the health bar, the beacon effects. I do like the way that the, the bow works with the dragon, where you can get a combo going. Like, if you hit one, it slows her down, so you can hit more. So you can combo, like, five or six arrows. If you just get a good enough streak going. Oh, what the fuck? She's already purchasing. Wow! Loud roar. Big roar. Come on. Unperch, you asshole. Yeah. Okay, here's number nine. As always, prepare to get this one. Come on. Blow up. You know what? I'm just going to put my helmet on. Uh, because it improves visibility so much. And also, what the fuck is an Enderman going to do to me? Like, I'm, I'm fine. They're not doing shit. With that being said, after taking that off, I am hitting nothing. You know, I'm... Just for all time's sake, I'll... Ow. Bitch. There. In my th thousand days world, I popped a totem fighting the dragon. I was uh, on one of these corner blocks right here, and I jumped up to hit it, and it, it just hit me like six times in a row. And it was like, done, 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 done. It wasn't like, it wasn't like those clips where someone like, gets hit and it hits them like four times in a third of a second and they immediately die but it was like rapid fire and i popped a totem very well could have died and there is no way that bullshit is intended i'll put up the clip now that is not the game functioning as intended if if i use the totem there that's that's a bug i'm willing to i'm i'm willing to discount using a totem there because that that's basically a bug like, no way that shit is intended. So this is number 10, I think. Ow. That did a lot of damage. Like, she was basically at full health before that. You know what? Actually, I'm not going to use the totem in that little bit. Because my logic with that is, like... If I know about a glitch and there's something to, that I can do to prevent it and I still die, then my logic is that, like, that that's a death. That counts. Even if it was, uh, like, unintended game mechanic. I would feel weird not taking responsibility for that then. 
And here, I know that it's going to happen, so I don't see why I would use a totem. And now I have, I am halfway through, I got 10 done, and my bow's about to break. So I'm going to make a trip to the overworld and restock. Ow. Die. Anyway, I'm going to make a trip to the overworld to restock, and I'll see you probably tomorrow in real life. All right, well, I am back with another bow and a full restock of everything I'll need to fight the remaining 10 ender dragons. Uh, I did some other stuff around the, the base, like I built another uh, home, another tower for my villagers to live in. I don't want to derail this too much because uh, in the actual video, it'll just be a cut from the last recording. So let's just get straight to it. There. My routine last time was to wait here for the, the crystal right here to come back. And then as soon as this sequence is done, I shoot it. So something that I haven't wanted to, you know, figure out about... Uh, but something that has been in the back of my mind is I have resistance too, which means I could probably get pretty close to one of those end crystals when I blow it up and be fine. I'm not going to test this, uh, although I could probably test it in creative, um, uh, mainly because I don't want to die, but hopefully it'll bring me a little peace of mind knowing that I, I hopefully won't uh, die to that if I'm at least a little careful. You bitch. Get away from me. Fuck you. All right. Here is number 12. I'm going to collect some ender pearls so that I can quickly pearl out if I get under the dragon and another thing like what happened in my thousand days world happens where it just randomly brings me to the brink of death. Did I just two hit that enderman? <laughs> or was he already low? I can't believe I had to stoop to that level. Ow. Other fuck. There we go. Number 12 down. Bap. 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 There. That is number 13 spawned. I'm actually recording this way later than I meant to. I wanted to record it at like like a couple of hours ago, um, but I couldn't, and now it is 1.30 in the morning. Uh, this is just the, the routine... I got some good combos there. Oh, she's approaching. Or not. There. And here is number... Let me check, actually. Yeah, this is number 14. Ender Dragon number 14. You get out of my face. You don't intimidate me. Ow. 
What? Fuck you. Motherfucker. Look, I am very tired right now. And maybe someone with, like, this specific tower is fucked. So don't blame me. Well, I mean, you can blame me, really. I'm not gonna stop you. Anyway, for her to perch. Oh, uh, maybe. She is so high up. Oh, there it is. God, she goes, she leaves so fast. Ow. Bastard. All right, here's number 15. We're almost there. Oh, I totally forgot to get those towers. I think the perching has to be damage based. There's no way she would normally immediately leave like that so many times. What the fuck? She's like like flying all around this tower like in the perfect manner so I can't fucking hit her Fuck okay, it, I'm going aerial There That's number 15 Ow. That's like the closest I've been to dying this whole time. Come on. Perch or something. Once again, she's circling that fucking tower. Ah, uh, I wanted to get her while she was perched, but no. This is 16 or 17 down or something. Alright. I don't know why I've been shooting. I can't hit it. Ooh, I was close to that one. What the fuck? Ow. That was kinda scary. There. Alright, here's 17. I think. No, 18. Because I have 8 left. Nice long distance shot, okay. And nice voice crack. I'm doing so much trigonometry right now on how exactly to aim an arrow.
Wow, I missed so many shots there. That's what I'm talking about. That's such bullshit that you can't, like, if you prepare and get strength, uh, she just leaves earlier, because it's based on damage, not time. Ow. All right, here's, uh, eight, eight, nine, 19. The, the penultimate dragon fight. Oh my god, fuck you. Here. I hate these so much. You're already too high. You did. No, oh, you're not. Okay. Okay, well, it is now time for the final dragon fight. That scared me a little. I thought I accidentally blew one of them up and would immediately die. Wait, I have... Okay. I thought for a second that I didn't have unbreaking on my bow. Uh, no, it turns out I've just fired a lot of arrows. Uh, did I get that one? Yes. There. Okay, step one of the fight is done. Now it's time to hunker down and do damage. Oh, come on! Oh, no. She fucking pivots right as I would have hit her. You kidding me? Uh, at least I got good damage there. What the fuck? That was scary. There's nothing I want more than this dragon dead. Come on, none of my fucking shots are hitting. And there we have it. The final dragon is down. Okay. So there is the full ring of all 20 end gateways spawned. So I have very big plans for my uh, end. However, I'm going to delay telling you about them until either the next episode or another clip where I will tell you if I have decided to uh, extend this episode, or if I will just be making it the dragon fight sequence. Because if it's if it's more than like 30 minutes, I'll probably just make it the full episode. But I, I may be lacking content 
for, you know, this whole, a whole episode on its own. But now I have officially completed the first stage of my end project. Hopefully this time I'll actually be able to catch up on scripting and uh, recording voiceover for and editing all of the other videos on the backlog. Because currently I am scripting episode two. And uh, this is episode, what, six, seven? So the, the Enderman farm over here is another thing in the end that I, I may have to mess with later. It's kind of out of place here, and I, I would like to do something different with it. Uh, but it'll 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 get done in due time. And so this is goodbye, maybe, to this video. Um, I'm either gonna uh, y you can just look at the runtime and figure it out, man. It's it's ending or it's not, and that'll be it. Bye bye.